I remember when uh, I first started about five years ago, five and a half years ago, and I was, I was quite nervous at first coming back to studying. I'd been out of school for 10 years or so, and um, just getting the mixture of my training, my playing and studying was quite hard. Um, a lot of it had been done at night times when I was at home. And then things changed again when I had a little boy, so then juggling that again was hard, but um, at times it's kept me busy um, and something else to focus on rather than rugby, so it's, a, it's been great. We're a full-time welfare manager and he's big on players looking at getting things sorted post-rugby. Um, and this is one thing I wanted to do, I wanted to stay within rugby because I've been doing it for so long, but um, if I could get on the performance side of things and get my strength and conditioning degree, um, you know, that'd be great for me. And I've been able to do, do it here at UCLan and I'm, I'm very pleased. You know, we're, we're able to send players in um, and get qualifications and degrees and um, study for something away from the sport, but then there's also students who are here based in camp and then been able to come to the training facility, use that, whether it be in the gym, um, doing the strength stuff and on the field stuff or whether it's physiotherapy or is it masseurs, anything along them kind of lines. Um, the club's able to use them students as well and give them some kind of experience. So um, I think it works both ways and it's been a, you know, a great partnership. Unfortunately, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty busy. I've seen all the events going on around here. I wish I could get involved, but um, I'll have to celebrate in a different way. We've got a game against Hull FC tonight, so uh, looking forward to that one.